What is going on guys, Moraine here and welcome to the video. Now let's begin with the last video that I posted in which I asked you guys if I should compete or not, if I should do a show for the first time in my life. And um, if you watched that whole video, you would have seen that I, I want this deeply, like, like this is something that I feel right now um, is something I set my mind to and I, I definitely want. But then I asked you guys what you think about it and the support has been overwhelmingly uh, positive, right? So thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. Uh, for supporting me and, and my idea and this journey and um, for just giving your opinion in general. Um, but it seemed that literally 98% of you guys want me to do this shit. There's only been a few comments that didn't want it, but there were hundreds of comments on that video. So thank you so much. I highly appreciate it. Um, and um, yeah, man, I am so excited right now. I was already excited, but now, now the excitement is next level, right? So um, this is going down. This is happening. I am going after that trophy. So obviously, as I said in that video as well, don't know exactly what show, when, etc. But first, I'm gonna take my time off to build more muscle. Now I can finally say the word. I am in my off season right now. <laughs> I wanted to say that all my all my gym life. I wanted to say that. That's <laughs> that sounds so professional. <laughs> I'm in my off season, bro. <laughs> so yeah, in all seriousness, that is what's happening. I'm gonna focus now on building as much lean muscle as I possibly can. And um, this is kind of like the first vlog in which I'm gonna start that whole process because like during summer, like I've been partying, I've been like maintaining my physique. I haven't had a clear vision, a clear goal. Um, and now I do. So, you know, this is the official start of my lean bulk right now. All right guys, so it is gym time. I'm here back with Vianne. Hi. <laughs> and where are we? Because I've never been here before. No. This place looks sick though. It's really sick in here, yeah. This is uh, the bunker. It's a gym in Rotterdam. So it's a really, really cool gym. It's based on um, CrossFitters. Oh, really? Yeah. I'm gonna, started, I'm gonna lose all my games and get <laughs> injured now. <laughs> Indeed. No, it's based on, on CrossFitters, but now it's transformed. Oh, you used to be into the, CrossFit. Yeah. yeah. But now it's transformed in a boxing, fitness, outdoor like, circuit kind of. It looks gym. like they have everything, yeah. Uh, so here's all the machines and stuff. And then we have the boxing section, my favorite. Yeah? Yes. Okay, she's gonna shove some moves. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the outer space and I absolutely love this. This is so cool. There are so many obstacles and you can make yourself an obstacle run or you can just enjoy some stuff like a play playground yeah. for adults. <laughs> Currently following a new workout routine that I'm doing together with Stan and Man. Uh, today he's not here. Uh, today I'm training without him. But all the days before this, uh, we've been training together, and um, that has been so good because I would say the past two years I haven't like consistently trained with Stan because I've been like traveling a lot. I've been gone, and somehow just like with schedules and stuff, uh, we haven't always like done everything together. Also with injuries that I had or that he had. Um, and now we're really back on it together, back on a game train. Uh, but this new routine, I'm so excited about it because I've done this routine in the past couple times before and it is so good for gaining muscle, which is the current goal, you know, gaining as much lean mass as possible. Now, if you've been following my channel for the past few years, you know, I'm a big believer in high frequency workout routines. Um, so I often have been doing um, upper lower splits or push pull leg routines. Those are my favorite ones. Uh, full body, I think is amazing as well. Um, but now this routine is a little bit different and that makes it more fun for me as well. I've been doing like upper lower for a very long time or legs push pull. Uh, but with this routine, you still uh, focus on hitting every body part twice a week. You just split them in a different way. So I'm personally adding in even a six day myself. I've been doing this uh, because I really want to bring my caps up. And I've been like, I love training so much that I honestly want to be in the gym every day. I just know that for the, for the gains, it is not the wisest thing to do uh, because you also need recovery, right? So on the sixth day, I'm only doing calves and abs and then a little bit of cardio. I work on my stamina as well because I think that is important to keep that up too. So I'm um, going very hard at this gym life and I'm uh, really excited about this routine because I just know like how amazing the gains are of this routine and because I've done it many times in the past. And I'm actually releasing an ebook at the end of this month, uh, my short lifestyle ebook of this particular routine, uh, but not just that, but including like everything about training and how to make progress on this routine, how to utilize the routine. 
um, and it comes in two different phases as well. So you will complete the amount of weeks in a routine, which is eight weeks, then you do a DLO week, and then you have another phase during the routine, and, and both phases have their purpose in gaining as much, not just mass, but also strength as possible during the split. Um, so it is really a power building routine. You build both strength and muscle mass with the split, which I think is the optimal way of training. So with that said, today is this my favorite day, which is chest together with arms, man. This day is fucking the best day ever like this 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 is better than partying right now like this 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 is the freaking party as i said there is more power focused uh, strength and more hypertrophy focused muscle mass today is the muscle mass day chest and arms that's why it's the favorite day of the week so rest periods are a bit shorter than on, compared to the other day and the reps are a bit higher let's get it started completely staying away from failure as well <laughs> Second exercise is the decline bench press. Uh, so first did the incline, which targets more of the upper chest. Now we're targeting more of the lower chest. Chest in general, I feel like this exercise uh, really isolates the pecs a bit better. I feel this way less in my shoulder. Uh, so back in the day when I had a hard time like focusing on squeezing my chest and I always had a lot of shoulder activation, I really like doing the decline bench press. So that's definitely a tip I have for you guys. Obviously if you use the right form on this exercise as well. So at our gym, we don't have the decline bench press uh, back where I train with Stan, so that is a little bit of shame. But today I'm able to do it and it uh, feels amazing, I gotta say, but we have the decline hammer strength uh, machine, which is also good. I just prefer the actual barbell, so it's awesome. Uh, the girl's putting me to work. She wants to see if I can do this. The ultimate test. You use your feet, right, with this? Yeah, I use my feet. It makes it much easier. I'm, I'm, I'm the man, so I'm gonna do it without the feet. Fuck that. Yes, just go, go, go. Okay. Hey! <laughs> Easy! Nice! Now you have to come down! <laughs> but you did it! Oh, yeah. Yay! Now it's my turn! I know I can do this! I did it before, but I'm so afraid of heights and... I can do this! You got this! Okay! Yeah. yeah! Nice one. <laughs> so awesome thing about this routine compared to you know the legs before routine that I was doing is that it was always like two or three exercises for chest, like with the upper lower split it's like usually two. And now it's actually four on the on the on the chest arms day. And that's a lot for me, a lot of volume. I love it. Chest actually absolutely blowing up. Feels great. And uh, now that I eat more calories, obviously I'm able to handle that volume as well. So you know, the volume can be a bit higher than when I was shredding. Next exercise, weighted dips. A great exercise for the chest as well. Not necessarily only tricep, also chest, right? But you have to do it a little bit different. If you want to hit the triceps, you grab it very close. For the chest, you grab it a bit wider. And you actually lean forward and keep the shoulders back. You do that by like raising your knees. You see me, I tilt forward now. And now I'm pressing much more through my chest. Oh, that burns great. So last exercise for chest is a real isolation exercise. This is the lower cable fly. Um, so you grab them from low and go up high. Targets more of the upper chest again uh, because we just did the weighted dips, right? And the decline bench as well. Uh, usually I actually like to do it like not from completely the lowest point, but somewhere around here, around hip, and then fly like this. Uh, but they don't have an adjustable cable here. So instead I'm just gonna do it all the way from low, but usually I don't recommend it. I feel like I target the chest the best when they actually come a little bit from like the lower side, not from this low. But it is what it is today. We're gonna make it work. I'm just gonna grab a bit of a lighter weight and I'm not gonna fly like this. I see a lot of people do that, but then you actually also really use the biceps to move the weight. Instead, you wanna keep your arms to the side and fly like that. And I really squeeze that chest. Going to complete failure here. <laughs> nice job. All right, so chest is done. Now it's time to move on to arms. Um, in order to save some time here, you're going to do supersets. So it's going to be biceps and triceps. Um, like you do a set of each before you take uh, the rest. 
Um, so this is amazing. This bump is literally crazy. That's why I love this day. First, like chest bump is already unreal. Now we're gonna do arms too. This is kind of like the bro day as well. So I'm gonna start with biceps first and then triceps right afterwards. Um, first exercise, going a little bit lower in reps and then going higher in reps as the exercises go by. Uh, we do three exercises, three supersets in total. So here is gonna be the seated dumbbell curl together with the French press. So just did a regular dumbbell curl there. Now we're gonna do a hammer curl. Targets a little bit more of the outer biceps. We're hitting a bit of the forearms as well. And then we're gonna superset that with the lying skull brusher, right? So we're gonna do this hammer curl standing because I already did the regular curl uh, seated. So, remote, bit of higher reps here, 10 to 12. So the last exercise of the day and the finisher for the arms. Uh, this is an amazing finisher because it's just a cable. It keeps constant tension on the biceps and triceps. So first, cable curl, cable push down. That's it, higher reps, let's go. So this is it for this chest and arms workout. And this routine has mainly helped me back in the day uh, with growing my arms a lot. I often get the question, how I got these guns? Well, that is one of the reasons why, right? So um, if you have problems with lacking arms, try out this routine. Uh, as I said, the full ebook will be available at the end of the month. And um, next to arms, it is gonna develop, obviously, your whole physique. But that is one of the things that I found the extra focus really helped me with. So if you want those arms to grow, give it a try. I'll put the full routine of today um, in the description box down below as well, so you can Give it a try yourself. So what I want to do now is show you guys some of the new items that Alpha Lead is dropping because by the time this video is live, that is most likely tomorrow. Uh, so I thought I would give you guys an overview of the new items and also how they fit on me, what my favorite items are, etc. So first up, this is part of the new Lux collection, the Lux Sleeveless Tee. It's an extremely soft, smooth fabric. Um, really, really amazing. And you guys saw me wear this in the gym as well um, in a different color, right? And that was definitely my favorite color when I was wearing in the gym. Uh, but in black, it's very clean as well. You can rock this in the gym, but also casually, I would say, um, because it doesn't have a massive, you know, cut in the back. It's not like a stringer, right? So um, got the scoop down here on the side, as you can see, and very minimal branding there as well. Next, this is also part of the Lux collection. This is the scoop T. Right, same fabric, feels absolutely amazing. Uh, we got scoop here on the bottom again. Here on the back, maybe you saw it in the gym because it's the same thing on a sleeveless tee, but there is a seam that goes like all the way through the back. It's pretty sick. You can definitely see it now. And um, yeah, as far as colorways, this is surely my favorite color. Absolutely love it. I mean, it's so clean, goes with a lot of outfits. Um, here we got the minimal branding again, very clean. Um, the arms don't fit super tight on this one, um, as you can see, I guess. Um, so it's more of a little bit of a loose fit on the arms, I would say, a little bit looser compared to the next shirt that I'm gonna show you. So yeah, this one is called the Premium Rolled Muscle Tee. And um, as you can see, the arms come out very, very nicely in this shirt. So there's a big emphasis on, um, you know, show, showcasing the physique. Um, the shirt is also nice as far as the length goes, like it's not too short. Uh, that's what I often dislike about shirts that are very tight. And here the same shirt, but then in black. So all the shirts, items that I'm showing you right now are available in different colorways, right? So keep that in mind and go for the colors that you personally like. Last but not least, the premium cutoff. Awesome to wear in the gym. Uh, this is 100% my favorite color. Absolutely love it. I think it is super clean. Uh, we got the fish still there, side tilt on the side. And um, we got the rubber batch logo there. Very small. Arms looking pretty crazy in this. Now, uh, next to all the items that I showed you guys, um, there is also cotton joggers that are available. Um, these in two different colors and then also shorts in two different colors as well. Now, I'm personally wearing a large on top and medium on the bottoms on all of these items that I just showed you. And I'm 185 centimeters tall, which is six foot one. Now I'll put the launch date and the time on the screen right now. Keep in mind that some items sell out super fast, like sometimes even within minutes. That's why I thought it would be a good idea to show you guys. You already can kind of like make up your decision of what you want to get, if you even want to get something. But if you do, I would highly appreciate if you would support me in the process as well. There's two ways of doing that. You can either shop through the link that is in the description of this YouTube video, or when you're on a regular website, simply enter the code Marine at the checkout, and those two ways will directly support your boy. So I would highly appreciate it. Thank you so much. So that is my current workout routine. Now, as far as my diet goes, I'm currently- How much do you want? Uh, 30 grams. Okay. I'm currently- <laughs> Nice. That looks good. Here we go. Look who is back. Hello. Who am I? 
She's pregnant. And I'm on a diet. We're back together. On the sofa. <laughs> on lunch. The, exactly. <laughs> now, we were actually going to get lunch somewhere, but she is on a serious diet. Yeah, because I'm pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> we, are, we are not together, actually. But we she, are. Yeah, we're bros. We are bros. We're bros for life. Yeah, so we couldn't eat anywhere, right? Yeah. But that's good because I'm also on this serious diet trying to get my calories in. So no, we're just chilling here. There's no babies, all right? No worries, guys. <laughs> I get no, worried. That will not happen. It's any, not mine. That will not happen anytime soon, for me at least. <laughs> we, we have to that. ask the husband when I find him. Oh, when you find him. Yeah. It's, it's actually really cool uh, that we could be friends like this. I didn't really expect it, to be honest. I knew I wasn't. It. Huh? I knew it. Yeah? I was completely sure. In the beginning, it's kind of hard, but like most people that break up are not like friends like we are. Like, I would actually wingman her now at the stage where we are. You know? That's what we do. <laughs> That's we what ask we're each other for like... advice. Like, what do you think about yeah, this like, person? It was just it was sick. Like, and I just say, protect it's yourself. Dope. It's dope. Like, yeah, it's cool. Talk about your diet now, bro. Yeah. Okay, so I'm I not cooking anymore. I think that I'm gonna leave my diet actually for the next video in which I will do a full day of eating and show you guys exactly what I'm eating. So yeah, let's just keep it at that. Um, so stay tuned for the next video. Hit that subscribe button. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you very, very soon. Peace. Bye.